हेलो एवरीबडी वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल एवेकन ये स्टडी वी हैव स्टॉप्ड आफ्टर नोइंग द रेशियोज एंड वी हैव कंक्लूडेड हियर दैट साइन थीट इज इगल टू ए बी बाई ए सी कॉस थीट इज इगल टू बी सी बाई ए सी टेन थीट इज इगल टू ए बी बाई बी सी दैट मीन्स हाइट बाई बेस एंड कॉट थीट इज इगल टू बेस बाई हाइट इन दैट वे ये स्टडी आई हैव टोल्ड दैट वी विल लुक फॉरवर्ड फॉर द 90 minus theta part means if we we are just changing the base and height as we have already told as we have already told that in a right angle triangle the base and height for trigonometry is depending on the considered angle so in previous class or here i have also mentioned here that as we have considered the angle c or angle theta in that case bc is the base and ab is the height bc is the base and ab is the height now <clears throat> if we were considering angle a if we are considering angle a in that case we have shown here that angle a plus angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree okay then automatically we can get it from this equation that angle a is equal to 90 minus theta because angle b is equal to 90 degree as it is a right angle triangle and angle c is theta now we will write the same ratios considering the angle 90 minus theta now see one change is there see previously when we are considering this angle theta as angle c then this was the what this was the base now as we have considered the angle 90 minus theta or the angle a the base is ab now what we can conclude from here that the considered angle the considered angle <coughs> will be the two side one will be the hypotenuse and other will be the base and the height or the perpendicular will be opposite to the considered angle clear or not means reversely we can say in like that also the height will be opposite to the considered angle the height will be opposite to the considered angle so previously what was that ab was the height because angle c was the considered angle that is theta here 90 minus theta is a considered angle means angle a so height will be bc similarly so from here we can say that sin 90 minus theta is equal to bc by ac cos 90 minus theta is equal to ab by ac tan 90 minus theta is equal to bc by ab similarly we have right all here up to cosec 90 minus theta now the interesting thing is that see one thing sin 90 minus theta here and that is equal to bc minus ac bc by ac sorry bc by ac and cos theta is equal to bc by ac so from here so this is related similarly see here cos 90 minus theta is equal to ab by ac similarly sin theta is equal to ab by ac similarly tan 90 minus theta is equal to bc by ab that is equal to cot theta or cot 90 minus theta is equal to tan theta sec 90 minus theta is equal to cosec theta and cosec 90 minus theta is equal to sec theta from here we can conclude that from here we can conclude that or better we can write that cos 90 minus theta is equal to sin theta sin 90 minus theta 
इज इक्वल टू कॉस थीटा टेन नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू कॉट थीटा देन कॉट नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू टेन थीटा देन सेक नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू कोसेक थीटा एंड लास्टली कोसेक नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू वट सेक थीटा सो दिस विल बी द डेरिवेशन फॉर द फर्स्ट फॉर्मूला फॉर योर चैप्टर ट्रिकोनोमेट्री इज कॉस नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू साइन थीटा साइन नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू कॉस थीटा टेन नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू कॉट थीटा कॉट नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू टेन थीटा सेक नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू कोसेक थीटा कोसेक नाइंटी माइनस थीटा इज इक्वल टू सेक थीटा क्लियर सो हियर इज द फॉर्मूला साइन नाइंटी माइनस थीटा दैट इज इक्वल टू कॉस थीटा कॉस नाइंटी माइनस थीटा साइन थीटा टेन नाइंटी माइनस थीटा एंड सो ऑन दीज आर कॉल्ड कॉम्प्लीमेंटरी फॉर्मूलाज दीज आर कॉल्ड कॉम्प्लीमेंटरी फॉर्मूलाज ओके बिकॉज इट इज हियर थीटा प्लस नाइंटी माइनस थीटा दैट इज इक्वल टू वाट दैट इज इक्वल टू नाइंटी डिग्री मीन्स इट इज डिपेंड अपॉन द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री एंगल दैट्स वाई दीज आर कॉल्ड कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री फॉर्मूलाज okay so after covering this much the ratio the concept of ratios of sin theta cos theta tan theta and so on and this complementary formula we have already covered the two exercises within the four exercises of chapter 8 of ncert cbsc that is ncert book for introduction to trigonometry so now we will try to solve some question from ncert books so first question i am taking uh, exercise exercise 8.1 question number 3 i am taking <coughs> here it is given sin a is equal to 3 by 4 if you are having book with you you can see it is given that sin a is equal to 3 by 4 it is given sin a is equal to 3 by 4 and you have to find you have to find cos a and tan a you have to find cos a and tan a now remember what was there now remember what was there <coughs> suppose i am drawing a triangle this is a this is b this is c and this is right angle so here it is said that angle a means a is the a is the considered angle a is the considered angle got it na where you have considered that considered angle as theta at the time of concept when we are taking the concept at that time we have considered angle a or angle c as like that okay so now it is specifically given that sin a is equal to 3 by 4 as a is the considered angle so for this triangle this one is base and the ang and the side opposite to the considered angle is called height and this one is obviously hypotenuse okay so as we know sin theta equal to height by hypotenuse sin theta is equal to height by hypotenuse 
here it is sin a that means here height is bc that means bc by hypotenuse is ac that is given as 3 by 4 so we can conclude here in this triangle abc that this one is 3 this one is 4 yes or no this one is 3 or this one is 4 or you can say as this one is 3k or this one is 4k why I am taking this 3k and 4k because we have already told that these are the ratios means some multiple might be there we are not considering that one so that's why I am taking this was 3k and this was 4k after simplification you will get 3 by 4 so now what we will do Pythagoras theorem so using or using triplet Pythagorean triplet Pythagorean triplet AB will be equal to root over AC square minus BC square that is equal to 16 minus 9 that is equal to root 7 got it root 7 so what we have got that is ab is equal to root 7 k or root 7 whatever we have just multiplied some unknown multiple which is common for all so we have to what was the question we have to find cos a now cos a will be equal to ab by ac that is equal to ab by ac that is equal to here ab is root 7k divided by ac is 4k so that will be equal to root 7 by 4 similarly this is tan a tan a is what height by base height by base that will be equal to bc by ab so this will be 3k by root 7k that is equal to 3 by root 7 got it so like this you just do the other sum of exercise 8.1 and if you are facing any problem just comment below i will describe it or in the next video i will solve the question with proper explanation okay